Have you ever wondered what makes something alive? Let's explore the world around us and figure it out together. Take a look at these things. What do you think? Are they living or non-living? Pause for a second and make a guess. What makes something alive? Living things have special characteristics. Compare these living and non-living things. What characteristics do the living things have that the non-living things do not? Let's see how many characteristics you got. Living things grow, respond to stimuli, maintain internal conditions, use energy, can reproduce, and have organization. Non-living things, well, they don't grow, move on their own, need food, or any of the other things that living things must do to stay alive. Now it's your turn. Let's test your thinking. Is fire living or non-living? What about mushrooms? Or this little bacteria? Think about the clues we just learned. Did you guess correctly? Fire may seem alive because it moves and uses energy, but it can't grow or reproduce, so it's non-living. Mushrooms are alive because they grow and reproduce, and bacteria, although tiny, are living too. So, what did we learn today? Living things grow, respond to stimuli, maintain internal conditions, use energy, can reproduce, and have organization, while non-living things don't. Next time you see something, stop and think. Is it living or non-living? Keep exploring and stay curious. Thanks for watching. If you like this video, please like and subscribe.